Damien de Mulder Wyatt's making videographers DSLR owners, but not making DSLR owners videographers. Camera brands seem determined that current DSLR owners must be converted to shooting moving images, and that by improving their video offerings and by continuing to talk about them and display them, stills photographers will suddenly press the red button instead of the silver one. Do they actually not understand how much is involved? There has certainly been an upturn in the use of DSLRs for video work, and some of it quite high profile, but the reality is that it is video makers turning to DSLRs rather than DSLR users turning to video. Both Canon and Nikon are guilty of making vulnerable folk like me feel not that I could shoot video if I liked, but that I should, and that I am crazy not to take advantage of the amazing video quality of their products. What am I to do? I know how to use continuous lighting with no problems, and getting to grips with codec, bit rates, frame rates, compression and file formats is surely just a matter of a bit of reading, isn't it? I learned software for stills photography, so surely I can apply some of those same skills to working with video in new applications that require me to accurately marry sound with motion? And I should learn about sound. Find the right sort of microphones and discover how to get the best out of them. I should also attempt to shed my solitary working practices, taking on the life of a team player, sharing ideas and tasks with a producer and a sound engineer, and be cool with never being able to claim all my own work ever again.